good YouTube welcome back to another video in today's video I'm going to be seeing if the Glock 19 X BB gun can go through how far it can go through what I have lined up here for it to go through as you can see is this box right here hold on I might need to get you guys a little lower this box in a this box and a pillow so we'll see if that uh, the Glock 19 can go through it and then we also have the 9mm replica 9mm BB gun 177 cow. So we're going to be seeing what one does more damage. Here we go. There we go. That's a perfect angle. Like that with the camera. So this box, this pillow, this box, this pillow. We'll see how far it goes through. And first up, we're going to be doing the one I don't think will go through as many. This one, off safety, fully loaded up. I don't think this one will go too many, so we're going to do this one first. And actually, we're going to move this here like this. Like that. We'll see you guys back a little in case it ricochets. It probably won't, but it could. Let's see how this is going to go. And fire. Ooh, let's see how that went. Look great. If you. Oh, I can't. Well, as you can see, then that tip touched the pillow. It just went through the box. There. And it came out right there. Okay. Now. Glock 19X is trying. Loaded, safety off, and fire. I think it did the same thing, y'all. You know? Oh, this time it went through right there. It went through right there. Hit right there. And I have this as a little extra layer of protection, too, so it has to go through that. And that. So, uh, put it to the new side. I'm gonna do this. Like that. And see if I'll go through it. I'm gonna pop this one twice. Fire. Mm -hmm. See? Pillow is untouched. Oh, yo, look what happened this time. So it went through right there. And it came out right there on the other side. So it went through the whole, it went through the whole box. I just must have not hit the pillow. I just must not have hit the pillow. But this time, we do this. Okay. Let me see how good my aim is in here. Here we go. Next up. Ooh, well, I found the BB, so I fired two shots out of that one. And I'm pretty sure. Yep, it went in the first can. Exited the second can. You see the second can? And it went in the first can. And exited the second can. It's not easy. And it hit the pillow and bounced off. So that's what that one did. Let's see what this one does. Different spot. Take it off safety. And fire. Ooh, that one sounded a little more powerful. Well, I needed my baby's back. Alright, so that time it looked a little more powerful. Oh, and it chopped through it there and blew a hole right through the back. It blew its back out. Whoa, pause. And on this side, went in right there. 
came out right there. Move the back once again. So that time it lo almost looked like not the Glock, but this one was stronger. That is weird. This one does hold more BBs, and I do like how it holds it in the top too. All right, one more test. Another test we could do is let's see if the Glock 19X with the laser. Wait, hold on. The laser beam could make this tower fall. I'm sure it will. We'll see. Fire in the hole. Oh my god. What did that do? It did not make it fall. It just, it just shot right through it like. It just shot right through it. Oh! Alright. These bells. So that's a pretty lit BB gun right here. This one? Comment down below what one do you guys think I should use more of. Y'all, another thing is, I'm a trained professional, so YouTube do not take this down, and kids do not try this at home. I am a trained professional. Like I said, if my hand looks green, that is because I was trying to do a prank and it fell horribly. It's not green and yellow, but that is food coloring it. I was trying to do a blood prank and it ended horrible, so now my hand's just yellow. Yeah, but kids, do not try this at home. My guns, I keep them on safety when I'm not shooting. I'm a training professional. I know what I'm doing. I've been doing this for a lot of years, so yeah, do not try this at home. So y'all, one more test, and I'm gonna tell y'all something. I'm gonna try hitting that uh, that red. Hold on, but I'm gonna put this behind. Me. Yeah. I'm gonna try hitting that red thing. See it? That red thing in the box. I don't want to stand right behind it in case it never shoots. Oh my god, your boy's aim is on point. Look at that red thing on the box right there. Oh my god. Well, and that was without the beam, bro. Beam accurate, bro. With the beam, it's accurate. It's how that was out the beam. Ah. Alright, y'all. So, here's what I gotta say. If you're a starter and you're just now learning how to shoot BB guns or you just started shooting BB guns or whatever, you want to make a BB gun video or something, I would start out with this one because the kick, you know, it's a little wet and less powerful, a little easier to handle and stuff, you know. This one, the 177 426 Daisy. But now the big boys, y'all, y'all. I'd recommend this to no one younger than 10 because uh, this one's a little more powerful, I'd say. And uh, this one could shoot, no, this one can't shoot pellets. But this one, I'd say, is a little more powerful, a little more heavy, a little harder, the thing. Looks a little more real. So, parents, if you don't want your kids getting shot, uh, make sure they get the yellow orange tip. I tried, y'all. I tried getting the orange tip because I don't carry this outside. And, oh, shit. I just shot BBs everywhere. I don't carry this outside anyway. So, um, yeah, I don't need the orange tip, but I was trying to get it anyway, y'all. But it just, it just it didn't come with an orange tip, so. Oh, well, I don't carry it outside anyway. But, yeah, if you're a rookie, I'd prefer you go cop this gun. Because this is a really good gun, too, for a rookie. And if you're not a rookie and you're a vet, cop this gun right here. With the beam, get the beam, too, because the beam is important. You know what I'm saying? The beam, the beam. Alright, anyway, y'all, like I was saying, anyway, y'all, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave me a like, and I'll see you guys later on for the next video. I'm out. Peace.